Good morning, good morning, good morning, my darlings. Good morning, my PBP family. It's so good to be with you one more time. Let's do this one more time for Jesus. Hallelujah. Welcome to the altar of protocol breaking prayers. If it is your first time, please make sure do not scroll past. Stay here on this channel and listen to the prayers and pray along with us. We are a loving family that prays the scriptures. We are gathered here to war together. We are warriors in Christ. We are standing in the gap. We are interceding for you. This is going to be a life-changing morning for you as the Lord re releases all-round fruitfulness for you. All-round fruitfulness. Do me a favor. Copy the link. There's that button that says share at the bottom of your screen or somewhere on your screen. If you click that share button, it gives you a link that you can share on your WhatsApp groups, on your Facebooks, on your timelines, anywhere where you have got your friends, families, and frenemies. Make sure that they are here and they are prayed up. We are praying our way into 20 2024 and into 2020 and we end in 2023 rather in a bang in a flash in a top level anointing hallelujah we are making sure we are not going out empty-handed we are not going out silent but we are going forth in jesus mighty name so one more time everybody who's going to be watching this replay make sure that you watch and listen till the end and there is other content that is awesome on the channel make sure you visit it hallelujah make sure you are subscribing and following me on all all the social media channels, I I bet you, you will not regret it. I promise you that much. This is a destiny meeting and therefore you are going to be amazingly amazed and God of wonders is going to visit you in Jesus mighty name. Welcome one more time. My name is Pastor Fortune. It's so good to be in your house. It's so good to be in your car, wherever you may be listening to me from in Jesus mighty name. Help me write on your screens all round fruitfulness, all round fruitfulness. It is another day of the Lord and we shall rejoice and be glad in it. God wants you to prosper, child of God. I want you to know that God wants you to be fruitful all around. Hallelujah. As you continue to echo it in the comment section, God wants me to prosper. God wants me to be fruitful. God wants me to prosper and God wants me to be fruitful all around. Not in just small aspects, but in all aspects of life in Jesus' mighty name. The Bible says in the book of Genesis chapter 1 verse 28, I read from the King James Version of it. It says, that's why... That was why he blessed Adam and Eve at the creation saying, be fruitful, multiply and replenish the earth. Hallelujah. That is our first prophetic instruction and prophetic mandate that tells us that as children of God, he says, I have made you on my likeness and image. Therefore, you are to do what I'm saying you must do. You must echo and do what I've said. You can only be a child of God. That means you are a God yourself. Therefore, you are created the same instruction that was given in the book of Genesis 1 28, that you are to be fruitful, multiply and replenish the earth. That means everything around you needs to be growing. Everything around you needs to be progressing. That is why you are still moving forward by force in Jesus' mighty name. And this morning, we pray of, our prayer focus is all around fruitfulness in Jesus' mighty name. Begin to understand this child of God as we track the scriptures and pray together that when God spoke these words in the book of Genesis 1, 28, he spoke these words of a blessing over Adam and Eve, but he empowered, he empowered us so to speak, because we are descendants from that lineage. Hallelujah. He empowered us uh, by those words for all round fruitfulness. Hallelujah. So understand that you carry within you a divine enablement for fruitfulness all round and not in some aspects of your life, but all round abundant life, all balancing in totality in Jesus. Mighty name. So now that you understand that you've got this mandate to be fruitful and to multiply, you are to be fruitful in your body. You are to be fruitful in your mind. You are to be fruitful in your spirit. You are to be fruitful in your career. You are to be fruitful in your family, in your finances, and so much more. So you understand that this thing of fruitfulness, it carries through everywhere in Jesus' mighty name. You are to be fruitful in everything. Shout it in the comment section. I'm fruitful. I'm fruitful in Jesus' mighty name. So you now understand that this is the design that God has designed for you. This is the design of God for you in Christ Jesus. Hallelujah. He has not planned to change it. There is no plan to change. The design is still the same. The blueprint is still the same. There is nothing changing about that. He has not rescinded his word. He has not rescinded the blessing that he spoke over your life. He has not. He. This is the instruction he gave to the human race. It is still the same instruction. What is the instruction, Pastor Fortune? In case you missed it, I said, be fruitful, multiply, and replenish the earth. Hallelujah, somebody. All the more in this day, hallelujah. He will not back down on his word. 
He will not go back on his word. In 2023, whether you are on the December the 15th or you are on the December the 1st, he is not going to back down. You are still a candidate for all-round fruitfulness before the end of this year. You are still a candidate for fruitfulness from today and the rest of your life in Jesus' name. That is who you are. Take your neighbor and say, that is who I am. It is just who I am. I'm fruitful all around in Jesus' mighty name. So what is left for you to do? What is left for you to do is to learn to pray, to activate the blessing of fruitfulness in your life. Hallelujah. What did I say? I said, activate the blessing of fruitfulness in your life in Jesus' mighty name. And sure enough, that's the reason that we are gathered this morning. Hallelujah. We are activating these blessings. We're making sure we take no prisoners, no retreat, no surrender. All the benefits that God gives us, this is who we are, PBP. We collect and we run and we cash out. We cash out on all these benefits and blessings. We were not called for a life of suffering. Come on, somebody. We are called for the good life. We are called for a, we are seated in heavenly places in Christ Jesus. Hallelujah. Over principalities. We are dominating, being fruitful, multiplying and replenishing the earth. Come on, somebody. Are you ready to pray? Let's get to it. Jesus, in the mighty name of Jesus, I exalt your Holy Spirit. I, I praise your holy name. Thank you, Lord, for yet another opportunity to gather with your saints of God together and stand in agreement with them one more time in Jesus mighty name thank you Lord that you have given us this Monday to be fruitful and to, that Lord I can begin to understand that you want us to prosper in Jesus name thank you for prosperity thank you for your wishes of prosperity thank you for the prophetic word of prosperity upon my life and I understand oh God that just as you blessed Adam and Eve you also blessed us in Jesus mighty name this is who I am and there can be no other way about it hallelujah now begin to open up your mouth and begin to pray and thank God for his word and, and, and for the blessing that will empower you the blessing that guarantees our prosperity the blessing that guarantees our fruitfulness father we thank you we give you praise honor and adoration and Father God, the Bible says, and God blessed them, and God said to be them, be fruitful, multiply, and replenish the earth, and subdue it, and have dominion over the fishes, have dominion over the sea, over the fowl of the air, over every living thing that moves upon the earth. Hallelujah. The Lord, empower me, O oh God. Thank you for the blessing that empowers me to ensure that I'm in charge of all these things in Jesus' mighty name. Father, I pray this morning as I stand in agreement with PBP members, O oh God, that we will prosper and we will be fruitful in everything that we do in Jesus mighty name in everything that we shall touch we shall be fruitful in Jesus mighty name father we declare and we decree that in our fruit our fruits are being seen in our body in our mind in our physique in our projects in everything that we are backing on to do oh God the Bible says in the book of Psalms 113 and he shall be like a tree planted by the rivers of living water that bringeth forth fruit in his season his leaf also shall not wither come on somebody and whatsoever he doeth, he shall prosper. My God, that is me and you. That is our prophetic instruction. That's your matching order. You will prosper in everything that you do. You are like a tree planted, evergreen leaves, nothing withering in Jesus mighty name. Therefore, Father, we continue to pray. I pray over every single member of PBP, every single person that is seeing me for the first time on this broadcast in Jesus mighty name. Father God, I declare that they are fruitful in Jesus mighty name. I command fruitfulness in the works of your hands in Jesus mighty name. I command fruit Fruitfulness in everything that you will lay your hands on, it will prosper, it must prosper, it shall prosper, it will prosper, it will prosper, not just prosper, but it will prosper greatly in Jesus' mighty name. Let the beauty of the Lord our God be upon us and establish thy works of your hands upon us, O God. The works of your hands, establish it. The works of your hands, establish them in our life. Let them be established in Jesus' mighty name. My Father, my Father, as I continue to pray, I pray and I declare that the, at, at the sound of my voice, every single person who can see me, who can hear me, my God, in Jesus' mighty name, their land shall bring forth. They, are, they will bring forth in plenty. They will bring forth in plenty. They will bring forth in plenty. They will increase, increase, increase. Somebody shout increase in the comment section. You will increase on all sides. You will bring forth. Your wells of bringing forth of abundance will come forth clean, for, clean, clean and fresh water. Clean and abundance. Quite the 
ya bahasota clean fresh water clean fresh water in jesus mighty name father as we continue to pray we pray and declare that the lord is our guide and, it, and he is our shepherd you are the lord our guide and our shepherd you are our lord our guide and our shepherd in jesus mighty name therefore we are fruitful on every side we are fruitful on the right we are fruitful on the left in jesus mighty name the psalmist said in the book of psalms 23 verse 1 that the lord is my shepherd i shall not want there is no way i can have a lack there is no way i will not be able to have enough because the lord is my shepherd i shall not want not want of anything not want of direction not want of an instruction my god thank you jesus thank you holy spirit thank you lord i have all round fruitfulness in jesus mighty name now open up your mouth child of god and ask the lord to pour upon you the reign of the holy spirit let the reign of the holy spirit be poured upon you causing you to prosper causing you to flourish causing you to prosper in everything you do everything you do come on open up your mouth father holy spirit reign upon me reign upon me empower me to prosper holy spirit reign upon me empower me to prosper empower me to prosper until the spirit be poured upon us from on high and the wilderness is turned into a fruitful ground and the fruitful field be counted for a forest says the the prophet isaiah in the book of isaiah 32 15 we will stay here my god until the spirit is poured out until the spirit is poured upon us until the spirit is poured upon us until the wilderness is turned into a fruitful ground until the fruit field is counted for a forest amen hallelujah i declare my god that i will never know any drought no member of PBP will know drought. You will know drought. You will not know drought. You will not know drought. You will not know famine. You will never know scarcity. You can never be a candidate of scarcity. Scarcity is when you are not having enough. You are having lack. You will never know famine. I prophesy into your life in Jesus' mighty name. I continue to pray over your life and I pray and I declare that you have more than enough. You have more than enough. You have more than enough supply, supply of money, more than enough. You have more than enough to an extent that you are financially able to be so fruitful that you will give to others in need. There's a reason why God puts money in our hands so that we can not only be a blessing to ourselves and our family, but others in need as well. My God, pour out your spirit one more time upon me so that I can experience increase even in the area of my finances. The Bible says in the book of Jewel chapter 2 verse 26, and you shall eat in plenty. You shall eat in plenty. That means you are not, you are not budgeting your joy, budgeting your eating like that. You will praise the name of the Lord your God and he will deal with you wondrously, says the Spirit of God. And my people shall never be ashamed. Therefore, he says you will never lack of any good thing. Why should you not have choice whether you are having beef or chicken? My father, I pray and I declare that even the ideas that we have shall produce fruit. My God, I pray for the brains of every single person listening to the sound of my voice, even myself, my God, that my brain shall be fruitful. My children's brain shall be fruitful. They will multiply on all sides. They will be fruitful. They will fill the earth in Jesus' name. Thank you, Jesus, for ideas. Thank you for creativity. Thank you for good things that are happening, oh God. I declare that you are blessed of the Lord, PBP. You are blessed of the Lord. I declare that nothing and no one can curse you in the name of Jesus Christ. I decree no curse can attach itself on you and lay legal claim on you. How shall I curse whom God hath not cursed? And how shall I defy whom the Lord had not defied? My father... Thank you, Jesus, that we are delivered from the curse. Thank you for calling us out. Thank you, Lord, for helping us to become born again so that we can be free from the curses of mankind in Jesus' mighty name. Father, we continue to pray. Somebody open up your mouth and begin to pray for wisdom and declare that the wisdom of God is at work in you. 
Father, we pray the wisdom of God is at work in us. It is at work in us. It is at work in us. And because it is at work in us, it is producing excellence. It is producing success. It is producing prosperity. Excellence, success, prosperity in every one of your endeavors. You are prospering on all sides. Come on, somebody. Pray and ask the Lord to guide you. Pray and ask the Lord to strengthen you. He must guide you to victory. He must guide you to success. He strengthens you to achieve the victory. He strengthens you to achieve the success in Jesus' mighty name. Thou has girded me with strength unto the battle. You have subdued under me those that rose up against me. Aya! When the psalmist says this in Psalms 18, he says, you have girded me with strength unto battle. That means you have prepared me to fight on this battle. That means, he says, you have, you have subdued under me those that rose up against me. Those that rose up. Who is daring you to rise up? They shall be subdued. They shall be subdued in Jesus' mighty name. I pray for you and I declare over your life, PBP, that not only will you be blessed in the field, but you will be blessed in the city. You will be blessed in the field of your work. You will be blessed in your home. You will be blessed in your mind. Peace, my darling. You will be blessed in your body, in everything that bears your name. In everything that bears your mark, you will be blessed in Jesus' mighty name. And Abraham was old. The Bible says he was old, well stricken in age. And the Lord blessed Abraham in all things. So God is able to bless you in all things. Why would he not bless Abraham? Or why would he bless Abraham and not bless us? Father, I'm blessed in all things. I am blessed in all things. Pray, 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 child of God. I am blessed in all things. Declare it. Send it out. I am blessed in all things. I am blessed in all things. I am blessed in all things. Pray and ask the Lord to open up the windows of heaven and pour out the rain of heaven. The rain of heaven. Rain of heaven. Pour out. Pour out on me. Rain of heaven. Rain down on me. Rain down on my investments. Rain of heaven. Pour on me. Rain down on me. On my properties. Rain down on my work. Rain down on everything I own. Let it multiply. Let it flourish. Rain down on all my pursuits, on my projects, investments, everything of God. Rain down. Let the rain of heaven water this and nurture it to grow in Jesus mighty name pray that the lines are falling unto you in heavenly places you have a goodly heritage you have a godly heritage that means you have a prosperous heritage come on somebody the lines are falling unto me I have a I, I have a godly heritage. I have a prosperous heritage. The lines are falling unto me. Everything concerning your life is ordered accordingly in Jesus' mighty name. Father, we pray, Lord. We ask you this morning, let the river of life begin to flow into our spirit man. Begin to flow into our spirit man. River of life, river of life, river of life. Begin to flow into our lives. Begin to flow into our minds. Begin to flow into our body. Rivers of living water, rivers of life. Flow into our finances, Rivers of living water flow into our investments, causing us to be to have all round fruitfulness in the name of Jesus, causing us to have abundant harvest in Jesus' mighty name, in the midst of it all. Thank you, Jesus. Revelations 22, 2 says, in the midst of the street of it and on either side of the river was there the tree of life which bare the 12 men of fruits, and yielded her fruit every season, every month. That means non-stop. We don't have time out. We don't have dry season, no. It yields her fruit every single month. And the leaves of the tree were ever heading or ever healing the nations. They were ever healing to the nations. They are evergreen, healing to the nations. The trees keep on producing. They keep on producing in Jesus' name. Thank the Lord. Thank the Lord. Thank the Lord. It will happen for me. I'm increasing. 
all around fruitfulness. It will happen in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. I have all around fruitfulness. Not only do I have all around fruitfulness, but I have all around increase, all around increase. I'm increasing on every side. Thank God for multiplication. God wants you to grow. God wants you to be fruitful. God wants you to increase. God wants you to multiply. He wants you to multiply in more ways than one. Come on, somebody. If you can imagine it, if you can dream it, God can do it. If you can imagine it and if you can believe it and, and you can ask for it and you speak it into existence, it will come to pass in Jesus' mighty name. He is a good God. He does exceedingly above anything that you could ever ask, imagine, or think. But you know, to for it to be appropriated, it has to be by bold declaration. You have to believe it. And how do we know you believe it? You declare it boldly. You declare it in advance before manifestation even you praise him in advance and you thank him for it and watch his wondrous work being unfolded in Jesus mighty name confess and increase confess and increase multiplication in your life confess and increase in Jesus mighty name pray pray it into being pray it into being all round success is my portion all round success is my portion in the name of Jesus Christ you are getting a head start PBP the the, the fact that you even sacrifice that you woke up this morning you are getting a head start you are going ahead of time. You are going ahead of your peers. You have decided to put together all, all, your, all your points, all your issues. Bring them now in Jesus' mighty name. I am increasing in these areas in Jesus' mighty name. Ask God to pour upon you the spirit of increase. Ah, Pour upon us, O oh God, the spirit of increase. Pour upon us, O oh God, the spirit of multiplication. Pour upon us, O oh God, until the spirit be poured out upon us. The wilderness, Akadia Bahashanda, must be turned into a fruitful ground. Lord, anoint us. Anoint us for increase. Anoint us for multiplication anoint us in such a way that nobody can touch us. Nobody will have a choice except to prosper in Jesus' mighty name. Anoint us, Lord. Anoint our hands, O oh God. Anoint our hands with the Midas touch anointing. There is what we call a Midas touch anointing in the Bible. Anoint us, O oh God. We want the Midas touch anointing. Nothing lacking, nothing broken. Everything increasing and shining. Whatever we touch will grow and will grow in and multiply in abundance, O oh God. It will multiply abundantly in Jesus mighty name we shall be like tree planted by rivers of living water bearing fruit in, in its season all round 12 months my God in Jesus mighty name seasonal all the time in Jesus mighty name thank you Lord thank you for increase my God thank you Lord for increase in our lives oh God anything that is dead my God it is revived this morning you are touching it my God and it's receiving life oh God in Jesus mighty name Father we thank you thank you Holy Spirit Begin to ask the Lord for grace. Begin to ask the Lord to bless you with grace. Hallelujah. The grace that makes things, all things, little things, big things, many things, small things, that he will turn it around to much. He will turn it around to much. If it's little, it's turning around to much. Hallelujah. You are moving from grass to grace. You are moving from grass to grace. You are moving from glory to glory. In Jesus' mighty name. The Bible says, a little one shall become a thousand and a small one a strong nation. I, the Lord, Lord will hasten it in its time. Hallelujah. So God says, I'm the one that is going to expedite this miracle in its time. There is a time, there's a due season. That means me and you are a candidate of that. Father, we call forth our due season. We call forth our time. Our time is now in Jesus' mighty name. Father, we pray and declare that by the spirit of the living God, we will experience increase and multiplication in all areas of our life. In Jesus' mighty name. Father, we pray that we and we declare, oh God, that all our Ventures are multiplying and growing. Increase on all sides. In Jesus' mighty name, Joseph was called a fruitful bough, even a fruitful bough by well whose branches run over the wall. Therefore, our branches are running over the wall. We are so fruitful, God. We are moving in the overflow of fruitfulness. In Jesus' mighty name, Father, we thank you. We declare it, O oh God, and we seal it with the blood of Jesus. In Jesus' mighty name, the fruit of our body is multiplying and increasing. In Jesus' mighty name, none shall be barren in PB 
MVP in Jesus' mighty name. Father, we pray and we declare that the fruit of our minds, our, our the brains of our children, oh God, they are growing, they are multiplying, they are fruitful for the right causes, oh God, with the right information in Jesus' mighty name. Blessed shall be the fruit of our bodies in Jesus' mighty name. Blessed shall be the fruit of our ground in Jesus' mighty name. Blessed shall, oh Makori Hasanda, we shall increase in all sides in Jesus' mighty name. Blessed shall be our investments, our businesses are growing in Jesus' mighty name. Blessed are we, we are flourishing like a palm tree. We shall grow like a cedar in Lebanon. We shall be planted in the house of the Lord. We shall flourish in the courts of our God. We, we, we will be kadabashanda. We will be such, such that we bring forth our fruits even in, in your pension age, even when you are just what is it the word passively sitting there it will just be multiplying for you in jesus mighty name we will be fed and flourishing in the name of jesus oh pvp i declare and i decree that you shall walk in favor 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 you shall walk in power you shall walk in power you shall walk in miracles every single day of your life every single day this is not every other month every single day you are a candidate for a miracle you are a candidate for a miracle every single day in jesus mighty name lord by your favor you have made me a mountain to stand strong you have done done this and hid thy face and i was troubled says the psalmist in 30 chapter 30 verse 7 hallelujah oh my god all round fruitfulness all round increase and multiplication in the mighty name of jesus christ by the grace of god that will be made abundant and multiply on you in jesus mighty name oh they shall be calling you and saying that you are fairer than all men you will be set apart from the rest from the thousand you esther you are different come on somebody your grace shall be poured upon your children, O oh God, because you have blessed us forever. Father, we declare the wisdom of God is operating in our lives. The wisdom of God is helping us to produce. The wisdom of God is helping us to multiply in everything that we do. In Jesus' mighty name, we receive the wisdom. We receive the good inheritance. We receive the profit, O oh God. In Jesus' mighty name, I pray for you, PBP, that your labor shall not be in vain. Your work shall not be in vain, but you will see the joy and and any Jew that comes for that makes for increase and multiplication, you will see it. You shall not labor in vain, nor bring forth for trouble for your seed of the, 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 the Bible says the seed of the blessed of, of, of the blessed of the Lord. Kadiabasanda. You are the seed of the blessed of the Lord. You are the seed of the blessed of the Lord. And your offspring is also the blessed of the Lord. Hallelujah. Pray and declare that you are more than a conqueror. Oh, I hope I'm not moving too fast for you. I am more than a conqueror. I am more than a conqueror. I am victorious. I am triumphant by the spirit of the Lord, by the word of God. I am triumphant. I am victorious in Jesus mighty name. Now, thanks be unto God, which always causes us to triumph in Christ Jesus and makes manifest the savior of his knowledge by us in every place in Jesus mighty name. That's second Corinthians two 14. Blessed be God who always causes us to triumph that means victory is guaranteed there is no failure it's proof positive plan oh thank you jesus thank you for all round fruitfulness my god father we pray and ask that you grant us the power to prosper in all things the Bible says, you shall remember the Lord your God because it is him that gives you prosperity. Hallelujah. Prosperity neither comes from the east or the west. Hallelujah. But he is the one that gives you wealth and establishes you. He's the one that will establish the covenant he has with you. And then you will also see yourself flourishing. Father, help us to multiply. Help us to increase in all sides. So that we shall look back and we say, indeed, 2023, all round fruitfulness in Jesus' name. Thank you, Jesus. Increase us, O oh God. Increase us, O oh God. Now go ahead and thank God. 
Thank God for this moment of fellowship. Thank God for these prayers that we have had this morning. Thank God and seal them with the blood of Jesus. They are coming to pass in your life. In Jesus' mighty name, we give you honor, glory, and adoration, my God. Thank you, Abba Father. Thank you, Abba Father. Thank you, Abba Father. Thank you, Abba Father. In Jesus' mighty name, amen and amen. Thank you so much for having made time to join me one more time today. I will see you tomorrow again at 5 a.m. Don't miss it. Remember, we are on YouTube for this week and not on the other channels, but I will upload on the other channels as well so that they can also watch the replay. But remember, the replay is just here. So make sure you're following. You hit the subscribe button and you hit the like button and you're welcome to just go and eat up as much as you can in terms of the videos that are already on the channel. There's also is something that you can learn we've been live every single day of the year 365 all around praying and preaching so there is something there's a word that god has for you have an awesome day go and be fruitful and multiply and replenish the earth and have an awesome awesome time i love you dearly thank you so much i'll see you tomorrow 5 a.m south african standard time take care bye-bye